The opinion plenty of support for Joy Behar's new career move. Joy Behar, host of The View, debuted her brand new comedy program at the New York Comedy Festival. Behar's program, Bonkers in the Boroughs, five short plays, represents a significant shift in her career, so it was good to have co-hosts Anna Navarro and Sarah Haynes supporting her. To promote Joy's new endeavor, a large number of the VIEW team and production participants also attended the event. It's simple to determine who didn't show up when everyone else does. Regretfully, co-hosts would be Goldberg, Sonny Hostin, and Alyssa Farah Griffin were conspicuously absent from this crucial moment in their colleague's life. An insider revealed in a recent interview that Sonny was scheduled to attend the concert on Saturday and that Alyssa was unable to do so due to illness. Although Whoopi did not provide an explanation, it is possible that she missed the gathering because she had a job that day. Whoopi came in on her day off so Joy could get ready for the festival that evening, but Joy regularly steps in for her as moderator on Fridays. She not only writes the plays but also stars in one of them, Get Me Theresa Caputo, as if that weren't enough. Her main character is a tough Queens resident who wants to communicate with the hereafter. The plays are wacky comedies that highlight the unique qualities and quirks of New York households. Joy was born and raised in Brooklyn, attended college in Queens, and is now employed in Manhattan. She also grew up spending a lot of time in the Bronx and on Staten Island, so she is well knowledgeable about all five of New York City's boroughs. Get me Theresa Caputo, Greasing the Squeak, Born Identity, Let Them Eat Cheesecake, and Pearl Has a Visitor are the titles of the five plays. Will Joy depart, the view to devote more time to her new profession as a comedy writer now that her goals are clear. Despite her hectic schedule, she dispelled reports in September during an episode of The View's podcast, Behind the Table, that she might be departing the talk show. She claimed that creative people like her don't retire in a talk with her executive producer, Brian Tedda. She's actually working on a nonfiction book as well. The book will not be issued until late 2024 or early 2025 and does not yet have a title.